Hello everyone. Welcome to our channel. Today our topic is 4th class Mass Magic Workbook Semester 2. Let's go to Learn and Write Divisions Worksheets. Chapter Division Worksheet number 1 Subtopic Division Facts First question Write the division facts and multiplication facts for the following. A. 45 divided by 5 45 divides 5 so 5 divides 45 for 9 times 5 9 is a 45 so write 9 in quotient 45 write below 45 subtract 45 from 45 we get remainder 0 so 5 9 is a 45 so quotient is 9. So 45 divides 5 is equal to 9. Next to 5 9 is a 45. 5 into 9. 5 9 is a 45. Next to 45 divides 9. 45 divides 9. That is equal to 9 divides 45 for 5 times. Here, for each multiplication fact, there are two division facts. This is 1. 45 divides 5 is equal to 9 and 45 divided by 9 that is equal to 5. Next to be 64 divided by 8. So, 8 divides 64 for 8 times. 8 is 64. Subtract 64 from 64 that is equal to 0 we get remainder is equal to 0 so quotient is 8 so 64 divided by 8 that is equal to 8 8 8 is 64 next to 8 8 is 64 so here 8 into 8 8 8 is 64 next to 64 divides 8 so 8 divides 64 for 8 times next see 77 divided by 7 77 divided by 7 so first we take tens place that is 7 7 divides 7 for only one time 7 ones are 7 next to 7 subtract from 7 that is equal to we get 0 next to Bring down 7. 7 divide 7 for 1 time. 7 ones are 7. That is equal to 7 subtract from 7. That is equal to 0. Remainder is 0. So quotient is 11. So 11. Next to multiplication fact is 7 11 are 77. So here 7 11 are 77. Next to 77. Divided by 11. 11 divides 77 for 7 times. Next to D, 75 divided by 5. We start with tens place that is 7. So 5 divides 7 for only 1 time. 5 ones are 5. 5 subtract from 7, we get 2. Next to 5, bring down. 25. So 5 divides 25 for 5 times. 5 5 is a 25. So 25 subtract from 25. That is equal to 0. So we get 0. This is remainder. So quotient is 15. So that means 5 into 15. 5 15 is a 75. Or 15 5 is a 75. So, 5 divides 75 for 15 times. This multiplication fact is 5 15 is a 75. Or 15 5 is a 75. 15 5 is a 75. Next to 75 divides 5. So, 5 divides 75 that is equal to 15 times. Next question, 
Number of 8's in 72 are 72 divided by 8. So we start with the tenth place, but 7 is less than 8. That's why we take 7 and 2 together. So 72. 8 divided 72 for 9 times. 8 times are 72. We get remainder 0. So our quotient is 9. That, that means there are 9 8's are there in 72. Next, number of 9's in 117. So, we take 100's plus 1, but it is less than 9. That's why we take 1 and 1. That is 11. 9 divides 11 for 1 time. 9 1's are 9. We subtract 9 from 11. We get 2. Next, to bring down 7. 9 divides 27. For 3 times, 9 3's are 27. 27 subtract from 27, that is equal to 0. So, quotient is 13. That means, 13 9's are in 117. Next question, number of 5's in 125. 125 divided by 5. So, first we take 100 plus, that is 1. So, 5 cannot divide 1. So, we take 1 and 2 together. So, 5 divides 12 for 2 times. 5 2s are 10. 10 subtract from 12. That is equal to 2. Next, bring down 5. 25. So, 5 divides 25 for 5 times. 5 5s are 25. Subtract 25 from 25. We get 0. Remainder is 0. Quotient is 25. 25 fives in 125. Next worksheet number 2. Subtopic division 3 digit number by 1 digit number. Do the following. First one 612 divided by 3. 612 divided by 3. First we start with 100 plus. There is 6. 3 divides 6 for 2 times. 3 2s are 6. Subtract 6 from 6. We get 0. Next to bring down 1. So 1 is less than 3. So 3 cannot div divide 1. So 3 0, 0. 0 subtract from 1. That is equal to 1. Next to bring down 2. So 3 divides 12 for 4 times. 3 4s are 12. So Subtract 12 from 12. We get 0. Remainder is 0. Next to be 484 divided by 4. We start division from highest place value. Here it is 4. 4 divides 4 for 1 time. 4 divides 4 for 1 time. 4 ones are 4. So we write 1 in quotient place and 4 writes below 4. So 4 subtract from 4 that is equal to 0. Next bring down 8. 4 divides 8 for 2 times. So we write 2 here. Question place. So 4 2s are 8. 8 subtract from 8 that is equal to 0. Next to bring down 4. 4 divides 4 for 1 time. 4 1s are 4. So 4 minus 4 that is equal to 0. Next to 845 divided by 5. Here observe fifth table and we start division from highest to place value number. Here it is 8. 5 1s are 5. 5 2s are 10. 10 is bigger than 8. So we take 1 time that is equal to 5. So 5 1s are 5. Subtract 5 from 8. We get 3. Next to bring down 4. Next 34. So here 5 divides 34 for 6 times. 35 is bigger than 34. That's why we don't take 35. So we take 30. That means 5, 6 are 30. 
5 divided 34 for 6 times. So we write 6 in quotient. That is 10's place. So 5, 6 are 30. 30 subtract from 34. We get 4. Next, we bring down 5 from 1's place. So 5 divides 45 for 9 times. 5 nines are 45. So 9 hundreds place in quotient. 5 nines are 45. Subtract 45 from 45. We get 0 remainder. Next D. 480 divided by 6. So we start with the hundreds place. 4 is less than 6. That's why we take 4 and 8 together. 6 divides 48 for 8 times. 6 8s are 48. So we get 0. Next we bring down 0. 6 cannot divide 0. So 6 0 0. We get 0. So remainder is 0. Quotient is 80. Next to 994 divided by 7. Here also we, we start with 100's place. Here 100's place is 9. So 7 divides 9 for only 1 time. 7 ones are 7. Write 1 in quotient and write 7 below 9. Subtract 7 from 9. We get 2. Next bring down 9. 7 divides 29 for 4 times. 7 fours are 28. So we get 1. Next we bring down 4. 7 divides 14 for 2 times. 7 twos are 14. So we get 0. So remainder is 0. Quotient is 142. Next to 960 divided by 8. So here also we start a division from highest place value number. Here it is 9. So 8 divides 9 for 1 time. 8 ones are 8. Subtract 8 from 9. We get 1. So bring down 6. 8 divides 16 for 2 times. 8 divides 16 for 2 times. So write 2 in quotient. 16 write below 16. Subtract 16 from 16. We get 0. Next to bring down 0. 8 cannot divide 0. So 8 0 0. Subtract 0 from 0. 0. We get 0. So remainder is 0. Quotient is 120. Next to G. 624 divided by 8. So here also we start with 100's place. Here it is 6. So we take 6. So 6 is less than 8. 8 ones are 8. But it is less than 8. So we take 6 and 2 together. Observe 8 table. Is there 62 in 8 table? There is no 62. But here 64. 8 8 is 64. It is bigger than 62. So we take 56. That means 8 7 is 56. So we write 7. 7 in quotient's place. 8 7 is 56. So 56 Write below 62 and subtract 56 from 62. So we get 6. Next to bring down 4, that is 64. So observe 8 table. 8 divided 64 for 8 times. So 8 is 64. Subtract 64 from 64, that is equal to 0. Remainder is 0, quotient is 78. Next H, 871 divided by 9. We start with highest place of 100's place. Here 8 is in 100's place. So we take 8. But 8 is less than 9. So that's why we take 8 and 7 together. 87. So 9 divides 87 for 9 nines are 81. 9 times. 9 divides 87 for 9 times. That means 9 nines are 81. So write 9 in quotient place. 9 nines are 81. So 81 write below 87. Subtract 81 from 87. So we get 6. Next bring down 1. Observe 9 table. There is no 61. 
so we take less than 61 that is 54 so 9 6 are 54 so 9 divide 61 for 6 times so write 6 in quotient and 9 6 are 54 subtract 6 54 from 61 so we get 7 9 cannot divide 7 so it, it is remainder 7 is remainder 96 is quotient 96 next i 144 divided by 2 first we start division from hundreds place so here it is 1 there is 1 in 100 place so 1 is less than 2 that's why we take 1 and 4 together so 2 divides for 14 7 times 2 7s are 2 7s are 14 subtract 14 from 14 we get 0 next bring down 7 2 divides 7 for 3 times 2 3s are 6 subtract 6 from 7 so we get 1 so remainder is 1 quotient is 73 okay we will continue remaining worksheets in another video until then bye thank you